It's the weekend, South Jersey, and I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. We're going to break it all down for you here. And as I break it down for you, put on the sunglasses because you're going to need them today. We put this loop in motion for you. And where you see all the whites, that is clear sky. And look at the date and time here in the upper left. We just went from Saturday into Sunday. We start out Sunday with clear sky, but clouds start to build in, especially as we go into the overnight hours on Sunday. And this is all ahead of a two-part rainmaker that starts Sunday night. It doesn't end until Tuesday night, and maybe not even until Wednesday morning. We see some rain breaking out late in the overnight on Sunday night. So only 20% of your night will be wet. Monday, 60% looks to be wet, getting pretty close to a washout. We get into the warm sector for Monday night. And when it is in the warm sector, we are in the warm and dry sector. So we are on the drier side for Monday night. Tuesday, the 50% is a little misleading. We're going to be on the drier side for Tuesday morning. And then the wetter side for Tuesday afternoon. And it does look like Tuesday night when the cold front comes through looks to be the wettest time throughout this 48 hour period and there could be a little bit of back end snow as we wrap this up shouldn't really accumulate though in terms of rainfall totals 1.5 in atlantic city 1.4 in cape may anywhere south and east of the turnpike is going to be over an inch of rain we will see some areas of roadway flooding we have high school playoff football happening this weekend hamilton versus shawnee we see temperatures in the upper 30s for kickoff sliding through the 30s pretty quickly as that sun sets behind the south end zone at Rucker Stadium. Cedar Creek first hillside, 41 degrees, 40 degrees. Just a couple hours later as Holy Spirit kicks off against St. Joe's for our South Jersey football playoff game. Saturday, temperatures will be in the upper 30s here. Pretty similar to Piscataway. Temperatures 40 in Galloway, 40 in Cape May, all aided by plentiful sunshine. And then as we go into the nighttime hours, we have a code blue in effect for Atlantic Ocean and Cumberland counties. If you need the heat or know somebody that needs heat at night, there are resources available to you in the following towns or in the case of Atlantic County, you can visit Ready Atlantic. Dot gov. As we go into Sunday, temperatures in the mid 40s everywhere here. Morning sunshine and afternoon clouds. Then we go to our seven day. Pretty warm on Monday and Tuesday, but not the nicest to be out and about here. Again, it looks like Monday night into Tuesday morning. We'll have a good amount of dry time. So if you really need to do something outside Tuesday morning, maybe you're just trying to squeeze in some last minute decorating here. Well, you have a little bit of time on Tuesday, but still not the best here. Then the backside of it, temperatures will actually fall throughout the day on Wednesday. Then we go into Thursday feeling pretty similarly to our Saturday before we rebound for our Friday. Have a great weekend, everybody. We'll be back with you Monday for the latest in South Jersey weather videos. In the meanwhile, we'll keep you updated on social media, Facebook and Instagram at JoeMartWX, Twitter at AC Press Martucci, or you can visit our website at thepressofac.com slash weather.